What's up Glam Fam and welcome back. So I decided to change things up a little bit and I have to say I'm, I'm very proud of myself and I'm very happy. I'm very excited to share with you this look that I have created today. Um, yeah, I've jumped outside of my box, my cut crease, my like halo cut crease and half cut crease box because I was in, I was in the box. I was in it. Um, we have created something new, something fun, and I'm just so excited to share this with you guys. So let me get a little closer so you all can see. We got some glitter action, and I've carved out this eyepiece. It's nothing but fun, you guys. Nothing but fun. And you guys deserve the best, and I'm here presenting the best to you. So I really do hope that you guys enjoy this one. But without further ado, if you guys are interested in seeing how to achieve this sleigh right here, keep on watching, let the games begin, and let's get started. So, hey guys, I've already done one eye off camera, of course, so we're going to zoom in so we can jump into the details of this other eye. I'm going to go ahead and take Hunts as my first shade. I'm going to go ahead and place Hunts all, all up in the crease, just the entire crease, from the inner corner to the outer corner. I'm also going to continue taking Hunts onto my lower lash line, making sure to connect the top and the bottom, and we're just going to smoke out this lower lash line area. We'll be taking this orange red shade in the Warm Obsessions palette. So I'm gonna go ahead and take that shade in my crease as well, but keeping it more concentrated. It's a really bright shade. And then we're gonna blend out that red orange shade. I'm also gonna take this shade right underneath my lashes. Dipping into the shade Jax. I'm going to go ahead and take Jax in my outer corner first before I start to bring it all the way over. And we're going to drag this shade out and then I'm also going to pull the shade towards my inner corner. Taking my dark side eyeliner from Anastasia Beverly Hills, I'm going to go ahead and line my waterline and my lash line. And I'm also going to run Jax along that lower lash line. Taking the black shade in the Smoky Obsession palette, I'm going to go ahead and concentrate this black on my outer corner first before I start to blend it out. So I'm really concentrating this color here. Still using that black, I'm just going to go ahead and take this along my lower lash line to go ahead and smoke it out. We're going to connect the top and the bottom right here in this area and we're going to drag it along our lower lash line. Dipping into this tangerine looking shade in the Warm Obsession palette, I'm just going to go ahead and pat this shade on my lid and then I'm going to go ahead and dust off the excess. So to go ahead and carve out this eye shape that we have going on, I'm going to go ahead and take my Clinique um, Perfecting Super Concealer in the shade 24, which is deep. And I'm going to go ahead and start by doing the wing first. You want to cut above your natural crease for this. I'm going to take a little bit of chip and I'm just going to create some depth right outside of this line. Taking this gold shade in the Warm Obsessions palette, I'm going to go ahead and place this in the center of my lid and I am using the shade Dry. So I'm going to go ahead and mix my Ben Nye Glitter Glue and my Certified Glitter together to go ahead and do this glitter graphic design. So I'm going to go ahead and do a V in my inner corner. Now I'm going to go ahead and do the same V on the outer corner. Alright you guys, so that is pretty much it for the eye look. I'm just going to do my eyeliner off camera and apply my eyelashes. But for eyelashes today, I will be using the Lena Lashes in the style Lala. So I'm going to go ahead and do that and I'll be right back. And we are back with our eyelashes on and it's definitely time to go and finish the rest of our face. And the first thing I'm going to do is go ahead and bronze. And you guys already know what I'm going to take to bronze. 
Fulani from the Masquerade palette, of course. We're just gonna pop Fulani right where, right where it belongs, just right in here. Now to go ahead and carve out some cheekbones, I will be taking the Deuce palette by Juvia's Place, and we're taking the shade Chocolate, and we're we're just gonna go ahead and cut out some cheekbones because I uh, wasn't blessed with that kind of definition. So we're just gonna put chocolate right in here. <sighs> there is something wrong with me. Okay, so I just realized I'm gonna go ahead and take this shade and put it on my brow bone because a sister is tripping. So I'm gonna go ahead and highlight that brow bone. So now that we have the contour down, it's definitely time to go ahead and add some color back into our face. And I'm taking my OG, this is the Heron Blush Palette Volume 1. And I'm going to go ahead and take the shade Toby to go ahead and put some color back into this face. We're going to place this on the apples of our cheeks, like so. I love Toby. Oh, ladies and gents, it is my favorite time of the video and makeup application in general. It is time to glow. And so to glow, I'm taking my Ride or Die Glow Kit. Um, this is the Sun Dipped Glow Kit from Anastasia Beverly Hills. I am taking the shade Bronzed. This shade does me no wrong, ever. So we're just going to go ahead and glow. We're going to glow. So I'm just going to go ahead and put bronzed right, right, living right here. That's where she goes. Yes. So I'm going to go ahead and take a little bit of bronze on my temples. Um, just a little bit. We got like, a, you know, we want a little healthy forehead glowing action. Um, if you want a pop in forehead, I just go ahead and swirl that brush in there and really get the glow on your forehead but I am not a huge fan of an extremely glowy forehead I kind of just like that is that is subtle enough you know that's good I'm just so I'm gonna go ahead and take bronze on my cupid's bow my nose and on the bridge of my nose as well So I'm going to do something a little different for lips today. I'm going to be taking a new lip product from Lena Lashes, and this is their Baby Matte. And this shade is called Trending Topic. You can take a red if you want to, a gloss, whatever floats your boat, people. Okay, so you know, guys, you know it's last. I'm going to go ahead and finish things up with my Balancing Charcoal Facial Mist from Beauty Counter. And I'm just going to, you know, put everything together. And we are all wrapped up with today's tutorial. I want to thank you guys um, so much for watching this video today. If you enjoyed the sleigh, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up for me. You guys are more than welcome to share this video. Drop some comments down below. Let me know what you think about me experimenting with like different shapes for eyeshadow. How do you approve? I approve. But while we're still here, you guys are more than welcome to follow me on Snapchat, Instagram, and on my Twitter. I will be leaving all the links down below in that description box. And I mean, you're still here, and I'm not sure if you've clicked that subscribe button yet, but if you haven't, I'm just going to be a little pushy and tell you to go ahead and click it. You won't be sorry. Join this family. Let's be friends. It's an ever-growing family. And for my pre-existing subscribers and family members, uh, Pat on the back to you. You're already part of the family. I thank you and I love you so much for that. I'm going to invite you to go ahead and click the bell button. It's somewhere in the vicinity. Just uh, give that guy a little click and you'll be notified each and every single time I upload a new video, which is going to be obviously a new slave. We don't want you to miss the slave. But that is all that I have for you guys today. And I will see you beautiful people in my next video. Bye, you guys.